Well, I'm Jeff Buttonshaw. We are on the outskirts of Barrel. Um, I'm a retired farmer from the central west of New South Wales. Uh, we chose to move to Barrel and uh, I'm using some of my agricultural skills in looking after four properties for absentee owners. Well, I'm uh, 65, so I've been, basically I've done nothing else in my life until the last five years. Um, so uh, when I left school and went to Ag College and then from the age of 18, I've been on a family property and, uh, and then uh, my own property since then. It was a genuine mixed farming operation. Um, it, uh, you know, six and a half thousand acres, so if you come down here, it's, uh, it's a little uh, different. In, a, in, in old terms, a 18 inch rainfall, and you come down here to a 36 inch rainfall, there's double the rainfall. It's different ISA Hyatt. We were basically a winter ISA Hyatt. You come down here, it rains all year. Um, there are different issues, and that makes it challenging and interesting. And uh, um, so that is why I, as to, to do the best job I can for, for the people I, farms I look after, I've tried to renew my education a little bit by doing a couple of courses. Hello. Now these are weaned calves. They're, they're, their uh, mothers are now just starting to carve again. I've done a progress course, uh, a land scan course, and now in the in the uh, doing a progress plus course so halfway through that, <coughs> and I find it interesting. You know, I'd have been broke long ago if I hadn't uh, adapted to change. I mean, you're never too old to learn. I mean, anyone who who says that is uh, um, doesn't know what they're talking about. Uh, certainly, uh, uh, from a point of view of uh, pasture management. Uh, I find now, when I look at a pasture um, and grasses, before I thought, uh, I've learnt that quantity is not the only issue. Uh, quality of pasture is extremely important, and that's the greatest take home message of progress. I mean, apart from assessing the ground cover and how much feed is there, the, the, the uh, take home message basically is to, it's not only quantity of pasture, it's quality. Out west, where we, we protected riparian areas basically for soil erosion um, and uh, to stop degradation of soils, whereas down here basically it was we want to protect the quality of the water that's going into the streams and, and obviously in, eventually into the dam. This is an example of, of unstocked protected stream. Your, your watering points are artificial in troughs and that, and you, and you try and keep livestock out of uh, streams from an erosion point of view um, and, uh, and that sort of thing. And if you can, it obviously filters the water and, and, and protects, the, uh, protects the ground. As a farm manager, convincing certain of my uh, uh, owners that uh, by spending a bit of money you get the return um, takes a bit of convincing sometimes. They, uh, but uh, I mean, my my background is that uh, it's the old old saying: you get into you get out of it what you put into it. You know, and, and basically it's the same with. Uh, um, uh, farming is that uh, you must put some inputs in it to, to get the better output. My own farms were in a lot better condition when, when I'd left them and when, they, when I purchased them and, uh, and it's the same down here. I like to, uh, within the confines of uh, the owners, uh, to make sure that uh, the properties uh, are, are in a better condition than, than when I was first there. Old dogs uh, certainly can learn new tricks and it, it certainly hasn't done me any harm. <laughs>